All right, I just learned something. I didn't realize Mark Cuban's the honorary starter. Yes, he is, yeah. What? <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> I think that'll be exciting. Uh, a lot of people will, glamping like to know what it's going to be like. You know what? There. Whether you're glamour camping or just roughing it camping, mm -hmm. the overnight lows in the 50s, afternoon highs in the 70s, it's wow. awesome. And nice. there are all kinds of people out. I think I see more in the way of activity around the track already today hmm? than I have in years past. Oh, no kidding. Uh, maybe there's some meteorological reason for that. <laughs> okay, that's fog, folks. When it touches the ground, a cloud on the ground, that's fog, and that fisherman realizes his fishing is almost over. Isn't that dramatic? Look at that. If you weren't sure what that was coming wow. at you, you'd wonder. But I bet you oh underneath gosh, that incredible. fog is some great fishing. Because <laughs> they love... For my parents? Are you thinking about my parents? Hey, nobody goes fishing like the flies. <laughs> they, they love to crappie fish, and I hear it's great under a wall of fog like that. <laughs> well, let's back up a little bit. Those that are camping, the ground is a little squishy, at least for the time being, because we had an inch and a half to two inches of rain last night. What we don't have on radar now tells the story. We're dry in central Indiana. Uh, any showers that creep into northwest Indiana will be just a few sprinkles, but you can see trying to make the move into Benton County around Fowler, maybe Williamsport and Attica, you may have a sprinkle. You'll definitely see an increase in the cloud cover. Yesterday's thunderstorms have dropped one thing for sure, the humidity level and the temperature. Notice the wind direction change out of the northwest at 13. Very cool to the north, comfortable in central Indiana, and downright warm still in Evansville. 86, while well, we're at 73 in Indy. Fishers at 75, Zionsville 74. Temperatures tonight as cool as the upper 40s. How about that? So Chris showed you that they actually have uh, the uh, fire pits. They'll use those to stay warm. Temperatures in the low 50s along the Wabash River. In western Indiana, we're at 53 as you go through the day tomorrow. Temperatures back into the low 70s with a north wind. High temperatures tomorrow range from right at 70, Logansport and Marion, to nearly the mid 70s in Bedford and Seymour, anywhere in the metro area. North wind 5 to 10, and the temperatures in the 70s. Watch what happens. Here's your seven day forecast. We're on cruise control. Right on through race day, Memorial Day, a few more clouds. Summer-like warmth, 85 degrees. Chance for thunderstorms Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. Timing is everything. Mm -hmm. And it looks like it's well-timed that we don't have to be nervous as you go to the track on Sunday. A lot of people feeling good yeah. about that. It's a that. whole different experience all when, the when rain is not threatening. Right. right. I right. have total energy, total confidence. <laughs> yeah. It's going to be a good race. <laughs> Thanks, Kevin.